All right, chat. What is the next card to use? We've used the Porsche three times. We've won three times. Uh, we did have a suggestion of a, of a Merc. It is going to be an easier card to drive, but it doesn't mean a faster card to drive because Merc is quite stable, but it doesn't mean fast, especially around here. You kind of have to live on the edge around Brand's Hatch in order to be fast. Oh, it's, 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 it's a heavy boy. It's a chunky boy compared to the Porsche. All right, let's see. Oh, I'm starting second. I told you, chat. I told you. Oh, GT Arc is here. That's the guy that we were watching the incident with. That is not the best place to be using this car. <laughs> All right. Using the Mercedes in race B against pretty much the full lobby of 911s, apart from one Mustang and one GTR. Starting second, with first and third being very, very, very fast, I'm probably not going to survive. All right. Let's see. Starting second, so not first anymore. Let's see what we can do. P1 was only a couple of thousands faster than me, so we should be quite close on pace, but he isn't the car that you want to be using around here when I am not. And P3 is quite fast as well. Let's see. Let's see. Alright, let's go. Let's have a clean start. Come on, get on the power. Eh, that was sloppy. This car is quite under series, so can I just throw it into the corner? A lot of wheel spin. I'm not really gaining on P1, but I have to. I'm also having to deal with a little bit of dirty air, which is quite strong for Group 3 cars. Especially through these long corners, it's quite ugh, tough. to try and get close to P1 so I could put pressure on him to force him into a mistake. Let's see if I can achieve that. He is... Never mind, he's just teleporting. Happens. I was a little bit late on, on the brakes. Oh, his connection bar is on one bar. That is... That is rough. Look at how much early on the power he is. Just gets that rotation through the corner, which I'm not getting. All I'm getting is understeer galore. But let's push. And again. Oh. Oh, that's, well, that's quite a rotation there. Ah. Oh. Yeah, I'm losing him. I'm no longer in the toe. That is not great. I need to break earlier because I'm not getting the rotation of a mid-engine car in this Merc. And expect the car to just pull me into the corner. I actually have to turn myself, I know, insane concept, which makes me quite upset, but sometimes you gotta do it. That was better, that was better. Slide gain.
I think I've gained this lap a little bit. Nice. Can we get into the tail? Not quite there yet. Actually, that helped me a lot. That slide there. Best of happens here. Need a good exit here. I don't get it. I didn't get it. Well, actually, I did. It was a better exit than his, so it's all right. We're in the toe. Actually, quite close. Now we get here with dirty air. But we are close, we might be able to force him into a mistake. <sighs> that was close. So the grass. Yes, another good exit. We are close. Three tenths. I braked really early. For whatever reason. P3, which is very, who's very close, is concerning as well. Oh yes, good exit. We are firmly in the toe. Let's see if we can make something happen. Is he going to defend? He is. I think he's just teleporting again. He's gonna reappear ahead of me some point. Oh no, he's just gone. Okay. Well, that was rather anticlimactic. Alright, now let's try and stay ahead of P2. If we can. Two laps to go. Oh, he is in the toe, which is unfortunate. Whereas P1, he disconnected. <laughs> He's unfortunately disconnected. He is close. <laughs> All right, final lap. Let's bring it home.
a small slide, but I caught it. Okay. Final corner. Let's get a good exit. And we did get it. Nice! So we're gonna win in the Mercedes against Porsche's 911s. Quite unfortunate for the leader to disconnect, but yeah, a win is a win. It was shaping up to be quite a good fight between myself and the first Porsche, but unfortunately he teleported again and teleported the helipin out of here. But it is what it is.